Hey guys, it's Fishali here. I covered Chelsea's game with Bayern Munich a little earlier and what a game it was. There was no hint really of it being a friendly. It was, well, it was very, very entertaining and it became competitive towards the end. Now I'm going to look quickly at the goals um, and then I'll be focusing on Morata and Batshuayi because I thought that was quite interesting where Morata played. So first thing first, the goals. Rafinha uh, opened the scoring for Bayern Munich before Thomas Muller scored twice to give Bayern a 3-0 lead within just 27 minutes. And in terms of how the game is panning out, Chelsea looked pretty confident in the opening you know, few minutes, but Bayern absolutely, um, you know, they, they blew Chelsea away with the intensity um, and the fact that they um, they really capitalised on a lot of mistakes that Chelsea were making. Chelsea were very sloppy and they left so many spaces, particularly on the wings. Um, and that's you know partly why they were three 0 down uh, within just half an hour. But they slowly got back into it. It was actually after the first half drinks break. I don't know what Conte said to the players, but they started to get back into the game. Um, before Marcus Alonso scored um, and then of course Michi Batshuayi scored in the 85th minute. It wasn't enough to get um, the win uh, for Chelsea but at least there was a comeback of sorts from uh, the club to restore some pride. Um, now what I thought was very interesting was Morata and where he played. And that's what I want to focus on today because um, he did get his debut for Chelsea um, after coming on. I think it was just after the 60th minute mark. Um, and he was involved in uh, Batshuayi's goal. I mean, he got the assist. Uh, it, he, he, he was the one who won the corner from which the goal came. And then he flicked the ball um, to Fabregas' corner onto Batshuayi, who of course scored. Now, what I thought was interesting was the fact that he played on the left of a front three. So Batshuayi played through the middle um, and William played on the right. Now, what will be interesting to see is whether or not Conte will utilise the fact that Morata can play in the left next season because, of course, Eden Hazard will miss, uh, I think, most of September as he recovers from ankle surgery. So will Conte use Morata on the left in game and Batshuayi up front? Because Batshuayi has really given Conte something to think, think about, something I've talked about in my last video blog. You know, he scored twice against Fulham. Um, he scored twice against Arsenal and of course now he's scored uh, against uh, Bayern Munich. So really, if Conte is looking at his options uh, up front next season, Batshuayi is making it hard for Conte to let him leave um, on a loan deal. Um, now I expect Murata to be first choice uh, for Chelsea next season, but at least it gives um, Conte something to think about in the opening uh, few weeks of the Premier League campaign. Now next up for Chelsea is a clash with Inter Milan in Singapore and I will be covering that game on Saturday and hopefully bringing you another video vlog then.